Hi, everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Tobolski. These rosters are absolutely loaded. Filthy amount of talent. Let's see what's in store for this hot matchup. The Panthers take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Gains the zone through the middle. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Carolina's got the puck along the boards. Tried to get creative by using the boards, but couldn't connect with it. Yeah, I think he just got in too tight to the defender here. You need a little more time and space if you want to be able to sidestep and get to that puck first. And play rolls on as he came up with a nice stop there. And that breaks off a stick. Flurry's last save was absolutely incredible, James. Not only was it pure desperation and athleticism, but I'm not sure how he can stretch that far. I think he's been doing gymnastics in his off time. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. Well, that's going to be an interference call, and it's a deserved one. You can't impede the forward progress of your opponent, and that's what happens here. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Flurry's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Drew's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Oh, love the defense. Scores! And they capitalize with the extra player on the ice, and it's a power play goal. While using the advantage of having extra ice available to them, James, that's why their most skilled players are on the ice. That one's executed to perfection. Well, the backhander's going to beat the goaltender on this one, James, but I, what I love about it is the effort to get to that area, that low slot area. You know you're going to have to pay the price. You're going to have to fight for position. He does all of it, and he gets rewarded. The Panthers get a hold of the puck off the draw. Taken by McCarr. Carolina's got the puck in their own end. And he coughs it up with the pass. The Panthers have been picking off passes left, right, and center. You know the coach is going to like this, but it has to transition to offense because this game's awfully close. Quick shot! You'll need more than that to beat him. Uh, he's such an offensive producer, and he just doesn't get it this time. And typically when he does, the whole team gets on his back and rides along with him. The Panthers cross the blue line and are on the attack. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. A rocket of a shot. He was good. Puts it off the outside of the frame. The Panthers leading this game doesn't get extended, and man, they would have loved that one for the extra cushion, but it goes off the post and out. And that's off a stick. Centering feed. Slides the puck up from the left side. Nietzsche's is hauled down. The official's arm is up. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. A tough penalty to take as you're looking for the equalizer here in a one-goal deficit, and you got to find a way to generate offense, James. Real tough one to take. The Panthers win the faceoff. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps him at bay. Well, this is a really great save, James. I mean, you can see that he's battling for position. You can see him moving up and down as his eyes are trying to track and find the puck. That's outworking your opponent and finding a way to make the save. Quick feed to Natchez. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here's a shot. Wow, what a stop by Fleury. Oh, there's one more. I'm not sure if anyone's helping him out there, but he's dialed in and doing it all himself, making consecutive saves. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. And they get the puck out of the defensive end. The Panthers will play the puck from behind the net. Nietzsche takes it into the offensive zone. Scores! There it is on the power play! Their power play has been really efficient tonight, James, and they're really gaining momentum off of it. And often when you're drawing this many penalties, teams start to play different against you. The Panthers are closing this period on a high note, now leading by two. Well, they've really taken control of this game in the first period, James. They've set the tone, and a lot of it's coming off of their shot selection. They're putting a ton of pucks to net. Quick shot! Wow! Couldn't catch up to that pass. And that's a great hits up play in the offensive zone. The Panthers have it now. Oh, he scores! Jonathan Taves! One
one defensive breakdown just leads to another and a huge opportunity for the opposing team, and it winds up in the back of your net. Puck scooped up by Lindstrom. Moves it in front. Off the stick, and they can't complete the play. Cuts to the front. Oh, what a stick save. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice is in the small area. He's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. The Panthers wanted to generate a lot of offense going into this one. They have succeeded in that game plan already here late in the first. Puck picked up by Jones. There's a burst of energy for the team with that hit. A much needed hit as well. You got to physically engage and find something to get you going. Both teams getting a good sweat on after this first period. We've got lots more in store, and we're coming back with a clean sheet of ice next. The middle stanza is about to go. The official's ready to drop the puck. Here we go. Period number two is underway with the score. Too much to not enough at this point. All right, Pounder, how would you assess this game through the first 20 minutes played? The Panthers came ready to play in that opening frame, James. They dominated possession. They were first to the puck, and they really set the pace in terms of their skating ability and their movement of the puck. They just need to manage that puck in the second and keep this game in their hands. Oh, he caught him! Oh, and that's a thunderous hit along the boards. It's bone-crushing, James. You feel that one right from your toes all the way up to your... Hold on a second, James. There's going to be a call on this as you see the official signaling a penalty. And another call against the home team, and these fans have... I think they've had enough. They've had enough, and they're booing at the officials and for the players. This is so frustrating. You try and kind of get the temperature of the way the official's going to call the game. And real tough to read when you get three in a row like that. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. Well, he certainly didn't get Mets Wood on that one as it just glides past the post. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. Flurry's got to make more stops like that, James. He's got to reset the momentum for his team. I mean, it's not about what happened or the present moment. It's about the next save, and that's the key contributor to reset this team and get them moving forward. Broken up by Lemieux. Picked off by Giroux. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Lemieux. Off target. Got it. Big time save. Oh, my goodness. Well, throw technique out the window. Play continues. Listen to these fans. They're starting to get loud and recognizing what we saw not long ago here, Cheryl. Yeah, James. I mean, they're continuing to acknowledge the save he made earlier because they know the temperature of this game. And, hey, the fans are now in it. They're all on board. And guess what? The goaltender knows it. And he'll take a moment to regroup back at center. Redirected out front. Find some space in the corner. Referee's hand shoots high in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up. Moves it to the middle. He scores! What a goal! Carolina's finally got the counterpunch they need. Now, can they do it again, Cheryl? That's the question. Well, they need the knockout punch, don't they? And if they're going to get two and claw their way back in this one, but the momentum's in their favor right now. But it's their choice to do something with it. Takes the feed from the goaltender. Takes it and looks ahead. Reeves looks around. Blocked in front. Oh, shot! Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. Makes a move, and the puck hops away from him. Ref's arms in the air. We got a penalty coming up. The Panthers carry it along the wall. And the goaltender gets to the bench. They've got the extra attacker out. On the tip. Whistle blown, stopping the play. The checkers don't like it, but they'll serve two in the penalty box. Well, I expect that they're going to go back to the umbrella formation, James. They had success earlier on it on the power play with three of five trying to move the coverage. Hey, for everyone who wants to draw it up, it's exactly what it looks like, the top of an umbrella. And then you're getting the coverage to move around, and then you can use those cross-seam passes, and you can speed that up. He's got a little jump. Oh, it just kind of muffles that one. Well, he muffles it because he's in tight, and when you're in tight,
right, you run out of room and you run out of option as well. You've got to find a way to get the puck to the net. Carolina's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Fires it! That's glove by Luongo. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. And now it's grabbed by Point. Sends it across. Directed over to Gonchar. Natchez is about to get out of the box. And he makes the stop with the glove to get a piece of it. What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring here. Oh, he saved it! What a stop! Wow, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and send a clear message to his team that he is behind and he's going to be the foundation tonight. They're really clicking here in the offensive end. All sorts of pressure. Slides the pass over to Natchez. Well, there you go, 40 minutes in the books. All right, friends, go grab yourself some water, get hydrated, and then buckle up because we got an exciting third period coming up in moments. And they are ready to drop the puck on period number three. They have dropped the puck here in the third. Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? Carolina's got to get the puck, James. I mean, to put it in layman's turn, one, you got to get the puck, two, you got to score. They're not doing either. Myers loving the puck. Look out, here they come on the attack. The Panthers gain control of the puck. The Checkers have it behind the cage. Here's a short pass to Natchez. With possession along the wall. Handles the puck at the point. Quick pass to Natchez. Great save from in tight. The goaltenders are the last line of defense for a reason, and this time, he bails his team out. Natchez carries the puck in his own zone. And that pass is redirected. Tries to the crease. Oh, you'll win respect for your teammates doing that. What a block. Oh, that's got to hurt. What a play. Knights, the victim of a slash, and the official caught that. We got a penalty coming up. zone now. Locks him. Fantastic save. The Panthers play it along the wing. Moves it to Barkov. Takes the feed at the point. The Panthers will play it from the point. Knight's got the puck. Takes the pass. Oh, there's a great stop by Flurry. All sorts of pressure here in the offensive end. They've really turned it up a notch now. Into the corner now. Skating with it. Waiting, waiting. Oh, a save! Penalty coming up, and we're going to get a stoppage in play. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. When the power play is working, James, man, does it feel good. Everything is working. The systems, the coach is happy, the team is happy. Everything is working in their favor. that they are not taking their foot off the gas in this third period here, Cheryl. Well, you can certainly tell that they bought into the game plan, and the coach is certainly ecstatic with the performance of the entire... And they're going to go! Team's bench is banging their sticks, standing up as they cheer on their player, and that tilt went their way. Did they find his tooth? I don't know if they did, but nevertheless, both teams lining up for the faceoff. Taves wins it in the neutral zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Puts it on that. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Look at that hit. Let's get physical. Oh, what a damn hit. He's got such incredible strength and balance. 
does need James. I mean, he's getting jostled off this puck or attempted jostled off the puck. And then he just gets lower and lower, positions himself to be able to hold on to it. Then makes a beautiful pass, unsuspecting one at that, that winds up in the back of the net. Carolina's got the puck along the wall. Broken up in the neutral zone by Jones. Puck grab by Pedersen. The Panthers play it along the boards. And he takes the pass. Oh, fantastic save! And he scores! Although this is an unlucky bounce for the goaltender, James, it's one he'll want back. These are the types of goals that can be deflating for a team. It's a scramble in front. Goaltender can't find it. And guess what? It's in the back of the cage. Quick feed to point. Shot, and that goes off the face of the goaltender. And they'll go the other way with a great play by Meyer. And there's the save. Taken along the wall by Jones. Pass across tonight. Driving right to the front. And just got a piece of it to keep it out. And now he passes up to Meyer. Picked up along the wall by Petrangelo. Oh! Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that park. It's some gymnastics at its finest. And there's the whistle icing the call. The Panthers' offense has paid off in dividends tonight. No shortage of scoring chances, and they have capitalized on many. And it is all over with this one. Cheryl, I like to try to preach to my kids, sharing is caring, but in this one, it was all about puck possession here. No sharing. Well, sometimes there's a time to share, and sometimes there is the time to keep it to yourself and be selfish, and really felt that they were evasive, they held the puck well. When the time presented itself to attack the lane, they did it.